In this lesson, we will discuss how to determine if a source is scholarly and how that may impact credibility. In particular, the essential guiding questions for this lesson are, why is it important to identify scholarly sources when evaluating source credibility? What questions should be considered when analyzing the scholarship of a source? And are scholarly sources necessary for the objective of the assignment? Whether an assignment requires scholarly sources or not, it's important to understand what defines a scholarly source, as they are most likely strongly encouraged. Scholarly sources can be further defined as academic sources, written by experts and most often peer-reviewed. Let's review the questions to consider for scholarly sources. The first thing to identify is whether or not the information is supported by evidence. Not only should the author mention other sources that validate the information presented, but they should also cite the sources from which that evidence was found. Look to see if the author references the other sources and if those reference sources seem credible. You can look for references in the text itself as well as a list at the end of the information. Next, a big clue will be if the source has been peer-reviewed or published. Peer-reviewed means a source was evaluated and validated by another expert in the same field with similar competencies. Most academic journals require all sources to be peer-reviewed before publication. Sources that are published will be found in academic journals or academic texts. Peer-reviewed or published work would most often qualify as scholarly and increase the ranking and source credibility. Last, any scholarly source should be free from obvious spelling and grammar errors or inappropriate language. If several editing mistakes or slang is found, it is viable to be questioning the scholarship of that source. As always, refer to the teacher and assignment instructions for what types of sources need to be included. Depending on the objective of the assignment, there may be times when a scholarly source is not required. Yes!